What is the electric flux? Flux means flow. In general usage, it means flow rate per unit area. For example, heat flux is defined as power per area. It is measured in watts per meter squared. However, for electric fields, flux has a very different meaning. It is a surface integral that is the product of the flow rate times the area. Recall that the electric field is a vector quantity surrounding charges measured in newtons per coulomb. In vector diagrams, it is represented by arrows pointing away from positive charges. Electric flux is a scalar quantity defined as the magnitude of the electric field times the area times the cosine of the angle between the electric vector and the normal vector to the surface. Its units are newtons times meter squared per coulomb. Because only the electric field intercepted by the area counts. Only the electric field perpendicular to the surface, i.e. the same direction as the normal to the surface, counts. For variable electric fields or varying angles with the normal to the surface, we must calculate the flux using an integral approach. Let's calculate flux with a simple example. We will take a small point charge and then close it in a perfect sphere centered on it. Because in this case, the electric field is along the direction of the normal to the surface everywhere, the integration just becomes a simple multiplication of the magnitude of the electric field of the point charge times the surface area 
of a sphere. In electrostatics, it is common to simplify quantities by using the constant permittivity of free space epsilon naught. It is related to Coulomb's constant as k equals 1 divided by 4 pi epsilon naught. Notice it simplifies the expression for the total electric flux from a point charge. Because electric field is represented by arrows from a charge, And the number of arrows represents the strength of the electric field. The graphical way of thinking about electric flux is the number of arrows intercepted by the surface area. If the surface area completely encloses the charge, then its shape will not matter. It will intersect the same number of arrows. This is also true regardless of the shape of the charge as long as it is completely enclosed. This constancy of the total electric flux of a completely enclosed charge is known as Gauss's law.